Have but you ever had a conviction before? Never, ever, never. You're now a convicted criminal. At this stage, I'm convicted criminal. Of course, I'm going to appeal into the county courts, the judges in the county court. Actually, some of them actually follow the law. It's not the same what the magistrates. We know the magistrates are so corrupt. Avi Mini for Rebel News in Melbourne, Australia here today with probably one of Australia's most infamous COVID freedom fighters, Leszek, good Polish name. But today, for an update on one of your many cases in front of the court, Leszek, what happened yesterday? Tell us. Okay, yesterday I was in the front of the magistrate Bailin in contested hearing. I was charged with a great offence uh, because I was more than 10, 10 cases away from home. In my defence, I tried to uh, present the case on, based on constitutional issues. We know that the magistrates cannot hear these matters. It's supposed to be straight away transferred to Supreme Court or at least to county court in front of the jury because there's lots of questions of fact for the jury. But the magistrate Bailin completely destroyed the, the, the pr procedure. He didn't give me any opportunity to defend myself. He didn't give me any opportunity to tender any documents. He basically says, I'm not interested in what you have to say. I am finding you guilty of $500 together with my wife. She is the same story. So we are probably the first Victorians who are convicted for the COVID fines. And funny thing is, last week, Friday, the prosecutor actually rang me and he said to me, if you play guilty, we withdrawn the charges. I says, no, I'm not, you, you can't do that. You know, I'm not going to play guilty, not ever play guilty. So you can see how this system is corrupt. You know, first they try to bribe you with some stupid offers. And then basically the magistrates are on their line. The Have you ever had a conviction before? Never, ever, never. So you're now a convicted criminal. At this stage, I'm convicted criminal. Of course, I'm going to appeal into the county court uh, probably in the next half an hour. This is not the first time. I had a few cases in the county court where I won because obviously the judges in the county court, actually, some of them actually follow the law. It's not the same what the magistrates. We know the magistrates are so corrupt. I didn't have opportunity to speak really to one uh, magistrate who was honest and who was actually looking at the case. I had another case yesterday where I proved that the statements of the police officer where she says that I was aggressive, I attacked her. It was on the video. I proved that in the court and magistrate says, look, I'm not interested in that because she sworn that you attacked her. So even the video evidence is not good enough anymore in the, in the courts, in the magistrate courts. The system, it's, it's, it's beyond the joke. Uh, we need to repair it. If you think it's important for people to know what's still happening in the name of COVID in 2023, how the state not only is chasing people for breaching the outrageous COVID restrictions, but the courts making law-abiding citizens until today convicted criminals. Make sure to like, comment, but most importantly, share it far and wide, and then head over to fightthefines.com.au and check out the other stories that are still happening now. And if you're willing and able, help us with some of those cases, fightthefines.com.au.